Hey guys. What's up? What tell tell me what's this already an hour? Uh you know, I don't know, man. It seemed like it I mean, it must it, have been What time is it right now? Uh painting time. Yeah, it was 1900 when we started, wasn't it? Well, I don't know. Yeah, I remember you saying it was like seven. Where you work. It must have been. No, 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 no. Not that early. No, I think, I think it was eight, so now it's ten. Yeah, could, could be. Could be. Yeah, well, actually, it's coffee right now, but I got my... I got my chocolate I forgot, milk. I forgot about uh, making me some coffee. Um, yeah, we had a, Oh, I know why I can't wave, because I'm not running the thing. So it's up to you. Yes. And yeah. because you're selfish a-hole, you're not going to wave so, at any of these people. I uh, don't have time to wave. You're seeing on your work and getting shit done, whereas I'm just here kind of jacking around. Yeah. You, you you know what Charlie there's uh, this uh, little cross on the top right um of the feet where your face is just showing if i tap that just lightly it will disappear i'll be quiet but, but <laughs> i won't do that man I'll be quiet i'll let you i'm you super can... i'm super glad you're here just and it's super cool the reason why that, no one's waving to you is because Colonel is kind of a jerk and he doesn't. Yeah, he doesn't exactly. So don't on. interrupt me, man. <laughs> Things I do. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so so I'll I'll. Um, do you want to host this event? No, you go ahead. I think it's better <laughs> on yours. Um. Do you? I th I think actually your your camera is way better than mine. Well, but you got the you got the the good connection and everything like that, don't you think? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I mean, it's entirely up to you. Um, when we can switch it back and forth and stuff like that. I'm I'm good with that. Yeah, we'll 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 see how it goes. Um, random menagerie. Thank you very much, Steelway. But make sure to share your progress or at least um, the end results. What's that? I've been following you over the past few days and absolutely love you. Great nights. I'm very inspired to steal your idea. Yeah. See, Colonel? Yeah. You got some cachet here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm totally not sure what I will do next on this guy. Last time I started with the highlights on the armor, doing a mix of the old Citadel bolt gun metal. Okay, I now have to hold the the paint pots to another spot in front of my tablet. I liked it better with you at the top, you know. What's up? Up on the top of the screen. Yeah. If you want, I mean, we could like take like a five minute break and just switch it around. You know, because I'm good. I'm good with whatever. Okay, then we'll 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 stay with this. I will adapt. Okay. Oh, uh, what have you done, okay. um, S? Sideways, like I was the other day. Yeah, yeah. Let's move sideways. <laughs> it's like, hey, idiot. Let's go like 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 in the old days. Like I don't know. Be nice to me. Is that that okay? think that would that's okay yeah 
Yeah, that's what I was doing the other day. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm an idiot. No, because um, uh, whoever designed and uh, wrote the source code for Instagram is an idiot. There it is. There's the right, right color, right color, right color. Okay, so I'll start with the with the highlights on the armor, and then walk down to the darker parts. But that's still not the shade of gray I had before. The stream keeps freezing up on me, says Arcane Warlock. That's because um, Charlie isn't moving much. <laughs> and uh, when when I start talking, I um, keep my hands still too. So that's um, possibly just special effects from yeah. us for you. We have a huge budget for these things. Um, yeah. Wait till the lasers come out, you know, and the... the yeah, we, we don't even control. know how to spend our millions, bazillions of dollars we earn every hour we do this. Well, at least I, I don't... I think Charlie um, spent a lot of his money for cho his cho special chocolate milk. My special chocolate milk. Yeah, the special one with the baby tears in it. Charlie's special blend. No, the baby tears is what I use to thin my paints with, and to stay mm. young. The 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 does one um, rule out the other? No. Okay. Do I like that? Okay, gotta be brave here. With the white. I'm just going to do like dots. So there won't be, there won't be like, it won't be a full on edge or anything like that. It's, it's going to okay. be just like little dots here and there. But you, you're doing, doing this with the airbrush, aren't you? No. No, oh, with the brush, is, okay. This is all this is all going to be brush work. I'm not that precise. Okay, okay. That I, could, that I could dot it. I would love to be. <clears throat> Get in a bit more ultimate gray into the mix.
silence. Yeah, this part's kind of nerve wracking on my end. Because it's not like white for me is such a hard color to work with on a brush because okay. it dries uh, so quickly on the brush. Okay. Uh, what kind of head? The guy with the halberd has... Where is it? Where is it gone? This one. And the flamer has the one with the mask, with the rebreather. Let's see. What Show us a close up. Lights. What time is it? Three oh seven. Okay, here. Okay. Same thing. Ah, nice. Yeah. Slowly getting the contrast. Yeah. So I'll just keep, you know, keep working, working that up at the spots. You know, take it high and then bring it kind of back down yeah yeah you know so I'll probably go a little bit a little bit more with it uh -huh. and then uh i haven't decided yet if i'll just do like a wash bacon on her <laughs> hi chris i like that um to take it lower because it's kind of looking like if I put a black on it, I think it'll get back into the into the black because mm -hmm, it mm -hmm. sort of looks kind of like almost too too bluish to me. So maybe I'll put that soft body black wash on it. Uh, I don't know if I'll. I don't think I'll varnish it because I'm just gonna tint it with it. Uh -huh. and see what that does but I still think I would need to go higher on the highlights or it's just going to be like too too subtle and I really haven't done any blending so maybe I could you know, go back and kind of get that on the model as well okay but we'll see And plug you in. Oh. There we go. All right. Mm -mm 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 -mm.
So now at this stage, I'm going to do more of a kind of like glaze. Yeah. So the consistency of the paint is just going to be, it's going to be really a lot of water or not actually mm -hmm. not a lot of water, but a little bit of paint. I'll dip it in the water and then I'll get it on the brush. So it's almost like I'm just like, uh, thanks ICT. I'll, so it's almost like I'm just getting the model wet, but not so wet that it's running all over the place. It's just like you can Moist. tell you brush there because the translucency of the paint, once it dries, will that color that I'm going for will, will show up. Kind of like, remember when we first started talking, Chris? And um, what? like when we first started talking, we were talking about uh, glazes. Yeah. And, and stuff like that. So like you get the thing, you, you're just basically getting the model wet with it. And that's, you know, letting it dry. And that's where the color is going to start to come from. But it's you just got to keep doing it over and over and over again with the glaze and stuff. So you saw what the last step looked like. Um, you know, I'm going to start doing that more, but I'm going to make sure to maintain, like, I'm just trying to dull the transition so that it's not mm -hmm. so sharp. Uh, kind of like blend it into the other so you can like have a hard time seeing my brush strokes and stuff like that. So it won't be going over the entire thing. So like I do is dip it in the water and then put it on the towel and then I'm kind of like if I can see it on the towel then I'm, I'm good. And then yeah. I'll run it across my thumb. I don't know. You can't really see, but like my thumb, you see like water on my thumb. That's kind of what I want. I don't want to see a lot of paint on my thumb. And the thing about this progress or this uh, technique is to make sure that the paint dries before you go to your next level. So you don't get the tide mark that's, uh -huh. that's on it, you know? Because that's when it'll, you'll get that like coffee stain looking thing. And that looks pretty bad. <clears throat> Not too much, too much. There we go.
starting to come along nicely. Yeah, I'm just doing doing the final uh, blending dry brush before applying the first wash on him too. And yeah, after after that they um, the no not there and not they but he uh, will be tabletop ready if you want so, but I'll. Add a further layer of detail later. Hey, Linda, what's going on? Yeah, I mean that's that's you you busted that guy out pretty pretty damn quick. Yeah, so like yes, the, the the other one, the one with the flamer, he just has to dry a bit, but he's pretty pretty much done. He just needs a bit more um, contrast. Bit more shadows and the 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 star real stark highlights and everything else is just um, for show. Now, do you varnish them at the at the end to kind of protect them? No. Really? No, I don't. No dull coat, nothing. No, because the dull coat uh, can seriously fuck up your colors. As can uh, a gloss varnish influences uh, the can influence the color and the transitions and the effect of non-metallic or metallic metals. I had that uh, with uh, my dark angels. They were uh, a rich dark green, and then I. Thought, hey, let's protect them with a matte varnish, and I uh, some I painted it on, some I sprayed with a can, and it uh, totally transformed the paint job. Ah, oh, it sucks. Through through a different uh, breaking of the light alone. Not not bad quality of the of the varnish. I'll do it, but I use it. I blast it through my airbrush. Yeah, if you're happy with it, and if it don't uh, doesn't interfere with the result, it's cool. It's also a good like if I'm doing freehand, I'll usually varnish before I put the freehand on. Yeah, yeah. So you can go to that point. Yeah, it's like a safe spot. Like a quick safe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, so what he's what he's missing are the the stark highlights and the brown brown shadows and a bit of a bit of cleanup. Yeah, they're pretty they're they look good. Like I said, like the cohesion between the two is uh something else. Yeah, ICT. It's a it's it's a good little good little trick, you know. But like I said, I use a I use an airbrush, so it it'll go on pretty consistent. Like if I'm gonna do decals and stuff, I'll usually gloss varnish what I'm gonna decal on. Yeah. Like for the Luna Wolves, I did that. Okay, let's recheck him. Everything's fine, so I'll go washing. My favorite part. You know, um, I um, think I'm going a bit McVay this evening. Yeah. And I won't paint the underside of the Helbert's blade. Because no one will see it.
Yeah, that's true. <laughs> so why? Uh, it's there though, and I'm sure. Oh, like, paint it. Oh, I'll paint it later. Be like I'll comment in the thing and be like, "Can I get a shot of the underside of that halberd, though?" I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, like, oh, only God will know. Like, why I oughta? You know, I'm like that guy, that misfit, such a dork. Um. So all I'm doing now is just like putting basically water on the models to get the get the highlights done and try and build a uh, less so you see less brush strokes up close so it's like kind of smooth and this part just takes me some time yeah to do yeah i i do my my the mo most of my blending if one could call it that uh with uh dry brushing too with little to no paint on the brush um you you will be able to i i can't even etch highlight my uh my checkers with the dry brushing really yeah Well, that's pretty swift. And it's <laughs> We're like, it's like two of Bob Rosses. You have a German Bob Ross and then yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The Bob Ross of, uh, like, kind of a, a, I don't know. Yeah, if I if I don't shave for about half a year, I even would have uh, the same haircut. <laughs> oh, Bob Ross, God bless him. Yeah, yeah. I love watching that guy's show. It's like he would just take a knife and go, and then next thing you know, it's like, oh, that's a mountain completely. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just do that. Yeah. You yeah. Know? It's great. He just knew exactly what to do, where to do it. I get some phthalo blue, alizarin crimson. I liked watching him in like food shows. Okay. On on PBS. Come on, transition. And bite. <laughs> okay, so I think the the Rack Rex is pretty much on. Yeah, there's too much. Let's see. How we can pimp the other one. <coughs> oh. Oh. I love this song.
think uh, I'm liking that a little more. Slowly enter, cause you know my room. Mistake was made. Oh no, no, throw it into the trash and start from the beginning. Hammer, I need to destroy this model. Quit the hobby. I can't let the good people of Instagram see me making a mistake. They won't respect me. Actually, that was a happy accident because I kind of like it. A oh, nice one. Just making it into a tiny cloud. <laughs> it's the happy accident. <clears throat> okay, there, 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 there. And maybe over here. then I think I got all the highlights what do you say what do you say it's a mix of what do you think and what do you say let's see oh yeah that's good yeah all the all the colors work well together Ooh, wait, hold on. Is that red on the shoulder? Yep. Ah, that is awesome. And red on the shield. Yeah. I like the kind of brass on the, on like the casing on the, um, on the, uh, what is that, a flamer? Yep. Yeah. Yeah, it works well. Like everything is, everything meshes uh you know perfectly well done son well done thank you sir very proud of this sir okay So now to the to the shadows, shadows into the shadow. I'll add some some more brown to the darker parts to get it this part rust part um, surface reflection to the metal. Mm -hmm. 
armor do it using um, the uh, citadel air range mornfang brown mornfang brown So what says the clock? Okay, we should have about 20 minutes in this stream. I need some more black. No, that's a gold or a green. Put it away. Okay, let's get... Okay, we're still, we're still going. Kind of lost in this. So now I'm just kind of going like back down on this. Okay. And just, and you know what? what it's going to look like is like putting dark next to the highest highlights on it yeah uh to sort of ooh i need to 
still going to have to work on these elbows a bit because they need more contrast there. But yeah. let's see what the leg, see if you can see the leg. Like I kind of like how that's how that's turning out. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Oh, yeah. You know? Yeah, I would have gone mad doing this. Looking awesome, dude. Thanks. Yeah, so, you know that in the picture, the left leg, I need to work on that a little bit more, but I'm pretty happy with the way the right mm, Yeah, but, but, but not much because um, the knee will need that only on the top and the shin, shin guard is um, in the shadow. Yeah. So I think it's pretty good like it is. And then the breasts... I don't know. I could probably take those darken up a little bit. A yeah, little bit. yeah. Um, like towards the top. Yeah. Uh, then a little neck piece, and then I need to build more contrast on the uh, bicep. Yeah. Because uh, that's not really showing up on this one. And then. Yeah, my my setup is directly going into the yellow. I wonder why it does that. It does that when you go to your table too? Your yeah. like kit kit bashing table. Yeah, yeah. Don't know. But I'm pretty pretty much done it. with with this one for now. Having gone to the into the deeper shadows with the brown tone. God, it's just such a badass model, man. And there's no cutting on that at all. That's just that's bog standard the model with you adding excuse me. With you adding like your own bits and stuff to it. Yeah, well, I I, I, I have cut away at the at the torso. The flamer needs some more details over here. What are you gonna put highlights or like scratches or something like that? What are you gonna uh, do? There definitely is missing a highlight and a bit more. I do want to do a color transition more from darker black to the green from here to there and from here to there. You can see the beginning of it on here and this highlight has to be a bit more intense. I don't know. Love it. What if you put checkers on it? Yeah, I've thought about that too, like on um, on this one. Yeah. Or, or a di like, diagonal slash, like but that, that would that would interfere with the with the tank. Yeah, I'll do a line, double line of yellow checkers. You think? Yeah. You don't like it with the tank, though. No. Well, I don't know, man. Just maybe. maybe no, the, the 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 tank is okay, but um, just some serious business.
when we dance. Yeah, that's it. We see. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's pretty badass, man. Right in the, you put it right in where the highlight is. Yeah, exactly. We'll we'll blend this a bit with a dry brush. Wait a few seconds till the the paint is dry, and then I can. Yeah, work it. I think it looks pretty good. So the the checkers are worn along the edge. Come on, focus. Yeah, kind of like it's like you said, like like worn in, and you know, figure what and, the lights are like. Some of the most experienced guys, right? Or um, if they they like, live, if they live out. Um, they come out living of an encounter with demons, yes. But I, I imagine these as um, being on um, on a longer crusade or something. And they are all um, out of armor polish. Yeah. And lapping, lap, lapping powder. Possibly they met with uh, Calder Drago and he sniffed all their lapping powder. Very, very grim darky. And I might add some more brown to the green over here. So it gets a bit more interesting, you know.
It's all right, I'll just go a little dark. Yeah. See, I even even drilled the barrels on the flamer. Let's see. Well, good on you. You should drill the barrels. It's a superior product. I'm surprised it doesn't offend your German mind. Like having a non-drilled barrel. Actually, I lied to you. Oh, okay. So you just painted it. You just deceived yeah. me. Yeah. <laughs> I hate you. I really hate you. No, I made a point. <laughs> well, I drilled the barrels. I painted, I mean, well, I painted the barrels on this, see? Yeah. I, I I will I will drill the barrels tomorrow. Okay. You can I promise. You want barrels. You don't want to drill those barrels. You don't got to drill them. I will drill them now. Well, not now, but tomorrow. But um, I will. Just for you. I don't blame you. You will. If I don't, you you will. I think you will uh, keep I'm keep this. You you'll back. ask me on every stream if I ha really have drilled those barrels. I'd be like, this guy doesn't drill his barrels. How does he have so many followers? He doesn't even yeah, drill, yeah, yeah. He drill the barrels. Everybody, it's like Colonel's dark little secret. He's not a not yeah. a barrel. Yeah. I think I think I might try. I might try to uh, take my photos in the future just so that you can't see um if the barrels are drilled or not <laughs> so, so that uh, people will ask themselves if you tell the truth or not <laughs> you try to make me look bad <laughs> like that's like i saw an alien i swear yeah he's over the hill he probed me yeah. I always will. Will from now on, we'll will take pictures from angles like like this. And then I'll just be like, you know, why he takes pictures like that, don't you? Because yeah, drill. yeah, he doesn't drill the barrels. There's no barrel drilling. Yeah, he he doesn't even have a drill. Now the thing is, you do. You do have a pin vice. You just yeah, but not. but you you need a special uh, barrel drill for drilling barrels. So who who who's hosting this stream? I do, right? Yeah, you are. Okay, so I I think we have about uh, two to four minutes left. Okay. And um, I will do a 10-minute break, eating some pizza, make a new drink. Okay. And then go for the other guy. Let me, um, let me see what's going on over here. If I can, I'll, uh, I'll come in. I'll host it. If not... Yeah. Just catch you later. Yeah. Just let me know.
for tomorrow. We'll yeah, I think as well. And it's, then um, this is the guy I want to start working on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, what's up, Bowers? <clears throat> I'll put him on here so you can actually see him like in his glory. All right. Ah, you know, you know what? I could try a thing too. Check him out about that. See that detail? Yeah, great, great model. I'm gonna have a blast painting this one, and I still haven't like shown you the uh, the backpack. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's perfect. Ah! Man down. Focus. Yeah, that's really good. What is he? Uh, that's the cataphracty. Yeah. Yeah. But and you're you're using him as just as a regular space marine, right? Exactly. Yes. So twenty five seconds. All right, everybody. We'll maybe see you all in ten minutes. If yeah. Not, have a wonderful day, and we'll just uh, catch you tomorrow. Just look for the. Look for either um, Colonel or myself uh, to start hosting. Exactly. Thumbs up.